Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know I haven't been on YouTube in God knows how long. I've been MIA. 2020 has been a year, let me just say that. None of us were expecting anything that happened. But I'm finally back to uploading. This video is a little bit different this time. I wanted to come on here because I got my hands on something that I've been wanting forever. Um, I don't know if anybody has been on the hunt for a vanity mirror that's under a hundred dollars but i was able to snag it on amazon i always noticed that they were around like 250 dollars to 500 dollars. i was able to get my hands on a vanity mirror that is in my price range so i'm super excited to share that with you guys also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for new videos in the future and like this video if you do enjoy but yeah if you guys want to go ahead and see my mirror and see what i got then keep on watching <laughs> Zoe is gonna be in this video today as you can see this is one of my dogs I have two dogs my black flat coat retriever you'll probably see her walking around maybe once or twice in this video but she's not as clingy as this one and this one loves to be by my side so let's say hi to Zoe featuring Zoe Yay. here is the mirror Stop, Zoe. Oh my gosh. Can you not? You see how clingy she is? It is called the Benchelin Lighted Makeup Mirror, Hollywood Mirror, Vanity Mirror Makeup Light. I don't know. But I'm going to put it right on over here so you guys can see it and you can screenshot it. And I'll also link it down in the description box too so you can find it as well. It came in this Amazon box. I was a little too impatient. I had to at least open this to make sure the mirror was in here. Okay, so let's check the specs real fast. I ordered this on July the 24th and it came July the 26th. So I ordered on a Friday and I got it on a Sunday. And it was $59.99. With tax, it came to $64.94, which I don't think is bad at all. It has 12 bulbs and it has a free compact magnetic mirror. Let's go ahead and open it up. pretty this is the mirror fresh out the box i was so happy because it came with the base already attached so i didn't have to put anything together and it came with this little plastic sleeve to keep the mirror protected i do like about the mirror is it swivels which is nice for people who are maybe a little taller or a little shorter and it is touch screen so these buttons are supposed to turn it on which we'll get to so the mirror did come with a detachable magnifier and it does attach with little suction cups that lock on the back I don't see myself using it personally, like keeping it on there, cause that's just not me, but I will be keeping it. When trying to take off the detachable magnifier, one of the suction cups did come off in the back, but that's okay because it does just lock like so in one of those little holes. It just comes with the user's manual to tell you how to work the lighting. It has three different lighting tones. The user's manual really doesn't have much on it. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. Tells you how to swivel, how to plug in the cord. But it is a metal base and I got it in white. Um, I do believe it comes in three other colors, black, silver, and rose gold. But my vanity is white. I'll show you guys that in a second. So I wanted to make sure it matched. In the box was the power cord to the mirror. It didn't seem too long, so that's one of my worries, but it is one of those circular plugs and you plug it into the back of the mirror. So I was able to plug it in, um, no issues. The cord isn't too long. Let's see if it works. Yay, it does. It works. So this is the warm lighting. I personally don't see myself using it. And then this is like the super bright lighting. And this is like the daylight lighting. I think I like this one the best. 
but I love the fact that it has this lighting. And I mean, look at how bright it is for a little mirror like this. What? So yeah, I'm super happy with it. Now let's go ahead and put it on my vanity. Okay, so here is my vanity right here. Um, I've never done a filming setup tour just because I'm still kind of getting things organized and figuring out how I want to do this area. But as you can see, my main source is my ring light and I have to plug it into that wall all the time. This is always in the way, it like blocks the hallway and stuff and then my dogs lay there, so it's annoying. I'm sorry, my carpet looks a mess. I really need to vacuum, but that's a different story. These are the mirrors that I use on a daily basis right now. This is just a regular mirror from Ikea. Um, I believe it's like 15, 20 bucks. And then this guy, this is my old reliable. That mirror has been through it all. It is leaning, it is broken. It is dirty, it needs to go. And if you guys want like a vanity tour or like a makeup tour, what's in my vanity, what's in my makeup uh, collection tour, let me know. I will definitely do that for you. There's just a whole lot of stuff in here. This, if you guys follow me on Instagram, this is contact paper. This is a regular desk that I got from Ikea a long time ago. It's actually not sold on the website, I believe, anymore, but I could be wrong. And this is contact paper I got for $5.99, and I literally just put it on top, and it made my desk look like a whole new bitch. Okay, I can link that down below, too, if you want that. But let's go ahead and see what the vanity mirror looks like. All right, so I was able to get my mirror on my vanity and I'm in love, oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Like I said, the only downfall is you can see the cord is not that long, so I'm gonna have to get an extension cord, but that's okay because your girl loves to online shop. It works beautifully. So no complaints, all light bulbs are working. Little power button right there turn it on and off and then this is the button to change the warmth of the lights and this is the button to dim it these are not light bulbs that you can detach so they are attached to the mirror if one were to break I would have to send it back let's turn this ring light off see how bright it is without it I went ahead and switched the camera and let me just say off the bat I'm so impressed $60 well spent and you know me I like to save a little when I can I mean I got even better than what I expected so Definitely get you one if you're trying to save your coins and have a nice vanity mirror with good lighting. If you're trying to start your YouTube and you want something affordable but also has good lighting, I definitely vote this as a yes. I also have my ring light, so if I ever need some more light, maybe some um, over here or over here, I can set them up so I have just a little bit coming in on me. But I'm so happy with this purchase, guys. Um, I'm gonna leave the mirror link down below if you guys wanna go and cop it. And let me know if you do buy it, what you thought of it, how you liked it. And if you have any questions, leave them down below, comments, blah, 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 blah. You know the drill. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up. I hope y'all enjoyed this little unboxing video. Definitely something different than what I normally do, but I had fun. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and subscribe to my channel for more videos in the future. But um, until then, babes, I guess I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, go save your coins, buy this mirror, okay? Bye.